Hello there, and welcome back to another video from Wondershare Dr. Phone. I am Francisco, and today we're going to discuss the causes and solutions to why my iPhone is stuck on the black screen. So it is still working, however, and as this issue is going to be specific to iPhone users, there are going to be solutions for Android users too. Before we start the discussion on how to resolve the S21 Ultra screen being black, but it still works, remember to subscribe to our channel. Also, make sure to hit that bell icon to receive updates about future videos. Now let's dive right in. Part one, why did my phone screen go black but still works? So the first thing that we have to discuss in this video is why Samsung Galaxy screen goes black but it still works and it is an issue that occurs in the first place. While there is no specific cause, multiple reasons can lead to this issue. In this video, we will take a look at the four most common causes behind this issue. Drained battery. Your phone's battery powers the device, including the screen. So when the battery level becomes critically low, your phone may automatically turn off the screen to save power, making you think that your iPhone screen or your phone screen in general is completely black, but it still works. It's similar to when your laptop or tablet goes into sleep mode, but when the battery is so low. App troubles. So sometimes certain apps on your phone can cause conflicts or glitches that result in a black screen. It's like when an app on your computer freezes and you can't do anything until you close it. To troubleshoot this issue, try closing the app that you suspect may be causing your phone to go, but still works in the end. Software issues. Software glitches or bugs can sometimes cause the screen to go black. Just like with computers, phones have operating systems like Android or iOS that control how they work. Occasionally, these operating systems encounter issues that can affect the screen, which makes you think that my iPhone or your phone in general goes black but still works. Hardware problem. Sometimes the Apple iPhone screen is black but still works issue can be related to a hardware problem. This means that there may be a physical issue with the components inside your phone. For example, the screen connector might be loose or the display itself could just be faulty at this point. Part 2. How to fix black screen on your phone. There are going to be many fixes available for the iPhone screen going black but still working. So which method is going to be the best one really depends upon what is causing the issues. In this video we will discuss four common solutions to fix the black screen for both Android and iOS devices. Method number one, force restart your Android or iOS smartphone as it is possible that temporary system bugs or glitches might be causing the iPhone or Android phone to go black but still works, the first solution that we're going to discuss is force restarting your device. It will flush out all of the bugs and reset the system processes, which can help resolve this issue. Now let's go through the steps of force restarting your Android and iPhone. For Android devices, what you need to do is first press and hold the volume down and power buttons together until the device reboots to resolve the Android screen going black but the phone's still working. When it comes to iPhone, it's going to be maybe just slightly different. For iPhone 8 and later, first quickly press and release the volume up button, then do the same thing with the volume down button, and now press and hold the power button until you see the Apple logo to resolve iPhone screen going black but still works issue through force restarting. For iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, press and hold the volume down and sleep wake buttons at the same time until you see the Apple logo. For iPhone 6 and earlier, you will need to press and hold the sleep wake and home buttons together until the Apple logo appears on the screen to force restart the phone. Method number two, uninstall or update outdated applications. So buggy or glitchy third-party apps are another big cause of why your phone screen could have gone black but is still working. In this scenario, uninstalling the targeted apps can help resolve the problem. Here is how you can uninstall or update the outdated applications on both Android and iOS devices. For uninstalling apps on Android, just navigate to the app that you want to uninstall, long press the app icon, tap uninstall, and then hit uninstall or OK to remove the app from your phone. For updating the app, just launch the Google Play Store on your phone and then tap the profile icon from the top left corner. Here, then just select Manage Apps and Device and open the Updates Available menu to update the targeted app. For uninstalling the app, find the app that you want to uninstall when it comes to iPhones and then long press the app icon. Select Remove App from the pop-up menu and then afterward, first select Delete App and then Delete to remove the app from your iPhone. If you want to update the app on your iPhone, just open the App Store on your iPhone and then press the profile icon from the top right corner to see all available updates. Here, use the update button to update the targeted app in an attempt to resolve the iPhone going to the black screen but still working issue. Method number three, inspect the LCD 
connector. So one possible cause of the iPhone or just the Android screen going black but still working is a loose or disconnected LCD connector. This is a cable that connects the display of your phone to the motherboard. If this cable is loose, damaged, or disconnected in general, it can cause the screen to go black. As it requires deep level technical knowledge, it is best to seek professional help for that particular solution. Method number four, perform a factory reset. If nothing has worked so far, you can factory reset your phone and attempt to resolve my iPhone or my phone screen going black but still works. Now, however, you need to remember factory resetting your phone will delete all of the phone data. Now let's go through the steps needed to factory reset Android and iOS devices, as it's going to be different for both operating systems. On Android, you're going to want to go to your phone settings, navigate to general management. Here, tap reset. On the next screen, select factory data reset. Now, Go ahead and press reset and follow the on-screen instructions to factory reset your android device from there when it comes to your iphone it's going to be just a little bit different but fairly similar first launch the settings on your iphone and then press general in the general settings just scroll down and tap transfer or reset iphone now afterward press erase all content and settings and then follow the on-screen instructions to factory reset your iphone from there part three how to fix black screen phone with an alternative so fixing the iphone or android device screen that has gone black but is still working, it can be a pretty tough task in general and can potentially result in data loss. In this scenario, you need a tool that can successfully resolve this issue with minimum security and data loss risk. So the best tool for this is going to be Dr. Phone System Repair. It is a near perfect system repair tool for both Android and iOS devices and can fix almost all system issues. This tool offers two repair modes, standard repair and advanced repair. Both are powerful repair modes and by using standard repair, you can resolve most issues without data loss. So here's going to be how to fix a black screen phone with Dr. Phone system repair. Step one, download and install Wondershare Dr. Phone. So after getting Dr. Phone from the official website, install it on your computer and then launch it. Now connect your phone to your computer and access the system repair tool from the toolbox menu. So for Android devices, what you're going to want to do first is once the program detects the device, select Android on the following screen and press start to initiate the process. Next, you will need to enter your device details like brand, name, model, country, and carrier. After providing the phone details, check the warning box and then click next. Now follow the on-screen instructions to put your phone into download mode. Once it is in download mode, Dr. Phone will start downloading the required firmware automatically from there. So when the firmware is downloaded, press fix now. You will need to confirm this action by reading the warning prompt and agreeing to it by entering the 000000 code. The repair process will start once you enter the confirmation code. Now, when it comes to iOS, it's going to be very similar in fact. So after the program detects the device, choose iPhone instead, and then select iOS repair to proceed. Now in the repair mode screen, choose standard repair, and afterward use the on-screen instructions to activate recovery mode on your iPhone. Once the device is in recovery mode, Dr. Phone will detect the device model and provide relative firmware. Choose the desired firmware and click download. When it is downloaded, do tap repair now to start the repair process. So repair your, your black iPhone screen. Finally, wait for the repair process to be completed. Once it is completed, your iPhone screen will go back to normal and the issue should be resolved. So with that, today's video has reached its end. Thank you for watching the video and we are hopeful that you were able to resolve your iPhone or your Android device, a device's screen going black. Now, let us know about your feedback in the comments and give this video a thumbs up as a token of appreciation. Finally, do remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive updates about future videos. Now with that said, until next time, enjoy.